guys, the camera's we'll go back some more. Persona 5 Raw. In the last episode, we got some of our confidants up, and we gained some new personas. Some very strong personas. Let's get back to work. And now, we are about to officially begin the infiltration. Now, let's keep going. We know the identities of the five VIPs. Yep, yep. A politician, a former noble, a TV station president, an IT company president, and that cleaner guy. According to the map, there should be a restaurant up ahead. That's where the politician should be, yes? Let's go, che let's go check it out. Yes. Let us. This way. Give me all this shit. It's all masked dudes in here too? We might be able to gain intel from talking to them. Just don't ask any suspicious questions, okay? Okay, let's see. I'll reveal your true form. Take you out. Why did I do that? Honestly, being an idiot. Aha. Uh -huh. Ooh. I give up, child. Please don't kill me. Let me your power. Thank you for letting me beg for... Wait, I just remember something important. I am not actually a child. Shut. I have existed in the sea of souls of humanity for all time. I am Dakini. I am part of you, too. That's how it really is. Okay, join us. Really like that EXP though, now, but let's I guess I could fuse you with something. Got a little bit there. Okay. Hello. My, this ship is such a comfortable ride. I must say, I'm absolutely impressed. It's no wonder the stability is superb. This is Congressman Shields vessel, after all. Mm-hmm. Quite true, I have may undergone hardships in my youth, but now a life of leisure is finally mine. Yeah, you do not understand. Let's take... Take him out! Cerberus? Bring on Cerberus? There. I'm about to royally wreck fucking Cerberus with your mind. Yes, I suppose I miss. Alright. Take him out. is too strong. Alright. The ladder, the stairs down here should be. It's not open. The lock's on the other side. Yes, no shit. Alright. I'm assuming that it's probably Oh, it's on the other side. Okay. Show me your true form. Yeah. Show me your true form. All affinities revealed. Oh. 
Don't worry. I got it. Wow. She sounds very manly. Sign for a members only restaurant. Where's the Torante Elite? You really can't read that either. Aren't you supposed to be a little Miss English or something? No. Yeah, Ryuji, that's not English, it's Italian. So, anyway, this restaurant is exclusive to members. Those without a membership card will be rejected. What? You gotta be a member just to eat dinner? That's such bull. Let's just go in. Hello. So if you wish to dine at a restaurant, please present your membership card now. <laughs> oh yeah, we heard about that thing earlier. What a pain. I believe our staff should have explained it when you board the ship. Apologies for the inconvenience, but may I please check your boarding pass, sir? This is... This is bad. We should retreat. It seems we won't be able to get inside peacefully until we can obtain this membership card. Yep, time to go back out and look for intel. There are a lot of people around here. Wouldn't somebody have to know about the membership card? I'm not sure, but either way, it seems asking around is our only option. You know what? To make this easier, so I can walk around here without having to worry about them, I'm gonna kill them. Okay. Seize B. Sarabasti. Join my cause. I love conversations such as this, so... Oh, I'm sorry, I remember now. In true fight, Nasha, I originate from the Sea of Souls. My name, true name is Saravasti. Henceforth, I am thou. New persona. Again, we can use that to make a newer persona. Now, let's continue. Your power is incredible, Joker. I know, thank you. Okay. Alright. They seem to know something. You! That reminds me, have you tried the restaurant ahead? Oh, not quite yet. I heard it has received high praise from a famous congressman. <laughs> Correct, you are. The good sir visits it almost every day. Okay, you you help me. Literally nothing. Do you know of the exclusive restaurant ahead? I wonder how you become a member. I haven't the foggiest idea. My connections only barely secure me on a place on the ship, after all. I suppose we're just ordinary citizens in comparison to other, uh, to some of the other patrons here. We should probably be thankful we're even allowed to dine in this lounge to begin with. Yeah. But they're, everyone's all trash either way. How am I gonna check if there's anyone around here that knows of a card? Oh, 
my stuff. Star Bossy within you, that I would like to give some experience to, to the me within you. Great, level them up. EXP. Quite finicky. Oh, it seems I've dropped my car for the restaurant somewhere around here. My, my, you won't be able to dine there without it. Have you tried consulting the staff? Haha, <laughs> not yet. I doubt there's any need to worry, though. I'll try asking around the bars later. I know Mr. Shio personally, so I'm sure he'll issue me a netter, a netter if I can find mine. Oh, how wonderful. I didn't know you had such lofty connections. No wonder you ex exude such dignity. Hey. Isn't this a good chance for us? You say he dropped his membership card somewhere. I'm not, I'm not keen on this, but we may be able to take it from him if we can find it first. <laughs> Hell yeah, he dropped it, so we gotta swoop in and take it. Yes, we do. And I'm assuming it's over here. Welcome, sir. How may I help you? Has anyone turned anything in? Hmm? What article are you looking for in particular? A membership card. Unfortunately, nothing of that sort has been dropped off here. Looks like this isn't the right place, Joker. Okay, you. Welcome, sir. How may I help you? Marco, you looking for a particular membership card? Okay. Okay. It's got to be down below then. Of course there's an enemy patrolling. Membership card. Ah, so it was yours. Please do not worry. We've been holding on to it for you this whole time. Here you are. Please go enjoy your meal, sir. Yeah. That was pretty, actually pretty easy. Should it have been that simple? Who cares? It's all thanks to that dick sheet of thinking everyone around him is incompetent. So he doesn't believe in anyone. That must be why there are so many membership cards around. Well, it's not bad that it went by quick. Let's head to the restaurant and grab a letter of introduction. Yeah. If, if we can get around so easily without that guard. Okay, there it is. Let's head in. Yo! Welcome, sir. May I see your membership card? Um, One of our targets, the powerful politician, should be at the restaurant. What's your call, Joker? Let's head in. Thank you for displaying your proof of membership, sir. Please head on inside. Seats marked with a blue flower are reserved for special guests. Please refrain from sitting there. What? Special guests? And who cares? A reserved seat is special information. That may lead us to the politician we're looking for. For real? Huh? That possibility didn't even cross your mind? Ugh, anyways, let's head in and find a seat. Man, things are pretty damn luxurious in here. Even the food looks super good. Oh Try not to get too excited, okay? You're embarrassing us. Yeah, Ryuji. God. You need to relax. That must be the table. Right. That influential politician comes here. Why don't we have a seat at the table next to it and wait for him? I'll go. He may become guarded if we go in a big group. Wouldn't it be odd with just one girl sitting there, though? Does someone want to come with me? I'll go. Hold up, Joker. Let me go with her. No, oh, she's my girlfriend. I mean, dude. It's a restaurant. Dude, I don't care. What are you, a preschooler? 
<sighs> I was wondering why you were so excited about this. Fucking cock block. <sighs> why isn't anyone asking me to do this? All right. We're going in. Everyone else stay nearby. I'll give the signal when the time is right. Man, what should I eat? Gucci is such a... You can't get full off of food in a palace. He's as dumb as ever. He's a fucking cock block. Uh, I can't read this. I'll have the sautéed foie gras, a salad garnished with truffles, and roasted lamb, please. Damn! I can't believe you can order so easily like that. I can't believe you're sitting there. Say, ain't we kinda young compared to the others here? They're all involved with Shido, yeah? They seem to be major figures in the political and financial worlds. On whose permission are you sitting there, brats? Whose? Uh, I don't see any reserved signs or nothing here. It'd be a nuisance if you'd make a racket next to my table. I wish to dine leisurely. Children like you who are simply hungry should leave. What was that? Skull, be quiet. Yeah. I apologize for our discourtesy. If you understand, then go home. Excuse me, but might you be Mr. Oe? Indeed I am. This will be an impudent request, but would you provide us a letter of introduction to Mr. Shido? From the looks of it, you appear to be minors. Why do you need an introduction? We wish to be granted an audience with him. His political ideology resonates so much with us. Of course, the same can be said about you, Mr. Oe. You have quite the silver tongue for one so young. Not that I mind it. Are you a high school student? Yes, sir. Speaking of high schools, I've heard that some principal somewhere kicked the bucket. He supposedly tried to leak Mr. Shido's name. Had he simply obeyed, he could have remained in the upper echelons. To think he would cast all that away. An elite such as myself can't even fathom why someone would do such a thing. If you pledge your loyalty, you're given the honor of selecting those who would have mental shutdown. Did you ask Mr. Shido to trigger a mental shutdown in someone as well? Hmm? Ah, uh, more or less. Considering your caliber, I would assume that the target must have been someone quite important. <laughs> important? No. The target himself was nothing that impressive. Oh, you must be being modest. You recall the subway accident early last spring? The one I had targeted was that engineer. Oh, that was you? It was to take out the president of some company and a diplomat who sided with current government. I see. That was very useful, Mr. Oe. Mm -hmm. Actually, my sister is a prosecutor at the public prosecutor's office. I could pass on what you just said to her. How about it? Won't you give us a letter of introduction? Is that a threat? Who are you two? The letter of introduction, please. Don't get cocky, brats. I'll never give you one. Looks like you have one, though. Well, guess it's time to use brute force. Guys! Let's go. Oh! Lucky me, I have that persona. So I know your weakness. I'll use my persona! Feel my rage! So. Something else. Got him! Oh, he's inflicted with burn!
I fucked him up. That was easy. He didn't get one scrap of damage on us. Get fucked. I leveled up. Hell yeah. Burn boost. Alright. connected to Shido after all. No wonder he was so adamant about me digging up information on the Phantom Thieves. Still, I can't believe Shido just killed him so nonchalantly. The entire nation is underwater in his palace. He must feel nothing toward one measly educator. In any case, even though that politician was cognitive, he turned into a monster. Up until Kaneshiro's palace, Cognitive beings were nothing more than weak presences. No, that Owe fellow just now wasn't a cognition. Hmm? But he had the memories and appearance of an actual person. He was probably a shadow fused with a cognition. It's like making the shadow wear human skin. I've never seen anything like that before. Such power is normally impossible. Wasn't Shido the one who destroyed the research done by Oracle's mother on cognition? Oh, do you think that when he did, he took the results for his own purposes? Shido. For all we know, Shido could have some hidden trick that allows him to tamper with his own palace. We need to be especially careful from here on out. Right. Yes, of course. I will continue accepting them, even after I am inaugurated as Prime Minister. <laughs> as expected from you, Mr. Shido, you are truly a reliable man. And in return, I only ask for your continued support. Standing up to the world does require money. Of course. I'll make sure to prepare compensation as thanks for your help in cleaning up. The incident with that accident in spring was very beneficial. This is all thanks to you, sir. If the study of cognitive science progresses, I believe it's possible to increase the target range. <laughs> I bid you good luck with that endeavor. I hope you will continue to assist us. Hey! Who should we target next? We still have four more letters. According to the map, the elevator ahead will take us to the pool deck. Hmm, if our intel is correct, there should be a womanizing formal noble there. <sighs> womanizing, huh? I am so not up for this. Okay. And the elevator is right over here. Let us go. Coach Charles in the mid starboard hallway. Alright, well, anyway, guys, gonna be a fast up to here in the next episode. We're gonna make our way through these hallways to try and get to the pool deck and get the second letter of introduction. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye!